Jean, um, owner and founder of Pipe Jeans, um, uh, a residence of Brooklyn, Van Island, New Jersey. Hi, I'm Leanne. I live in Harlem, um, and I'm a doctor, specifically a psychiatrist. All right, I'm LeVon. I live in Brooklyn, originally from Jamaica. I'm a writer and also I do sales development. Emily, and I'm Haitian and I'm from Brooklyn. Um, you can check me out, Emily Elise, on Instagram and YouTube. My name is Ken, also known as Really Doe. I am an artist slash pharmacist. Um, I'm from Brooklyn, New York, and I'm here for a current situation. I'm here to support my cousin. I'm excited. And I'm Lonnie, uh, born and raised in Brooklyn, uh, freelance graphic designer, occasional photographer, and every Friday I throw a pretty cool party called the Weekend Warm-Up that everybody should come to from time to time. Oh. Oh. All right. All right. All right. That's where we're going next Friday. Yeah. <laughs> when you date a black woman, you going to get the neck and some attitude. CC Kevin Hart. <laughs> if you need an example of reference. Yeah, well, the old uh, women that have oh, never yeah. smell like fruits and berries, I mean, I don't think that would be like... <laughs> that's a stereotype. That's, that's, that's a stereotype. Like, people feel like if they date like a Jamaican black woman, or it's a Jamaican woman, like, she's gonna be aggressive. Right? Like, I can't, I can't manage that. I co-sign that. Yeah, yeah. Yo, Jamaican, Jamaicans are difficult. I'm not No, we, we can be aggressive, but I mean, it's not always true, you know? But it always just seems like, oh, you're a Jamaican girl. You're the nicest that. Jamaican guy I ever met, for real. Like, oh, no. honestly, you're just shy. <laughs> you're always <laughs> When I date, you know, outside of my race, culture, whatever, the, the, the first thing that they think of, oh, like, does, does your family do voodoo and all that stuff? Like, come on, man. Like, you know, do voodoo? Like, do you know White Clef? Yeah. <laughs> men are aggressive. Oh, they cheated. Oh, they, they, been to jail. they cheat? They what? They've been to jail before. Come on, man. <laughs> Yo, what's really interesting? Thank you. Say that black men got like big dicks. Yeah. Men, they yeah. never talk about sex on camera like that. No. Black women are cheaters. That's a stereotype. Black men? No, black women. Women? West Indian women, especially. What? Really? Yeah. Have you ever heard any of that? Wait, so I'm just. Are you making that up? <laughs> Jamaican men have two or more families. Caribbean. <laughs> <laughs> so Haitian men, too. Hold on, I mean, you have African men. Okay. I mean, uh, Nigerians are scammers. Definitely still in Oh, and control them too. West Indian men are controlling. African men are controlling. Yeah. Or black men in general. Black men in general. They beat their women. Are controlling. Controlling. <laughs> I definitely yeah. heard that about Nigerian dudes that they hit their women. Yeah. Hell yeah. Africans are very controlling. I hear. And Nigerian guys are very aggressive in the club. Like, you have stories, right? Mm. They don't leave your side the whole time. No, no, no. Share some of the stories in there. I have stories. I have stories. Uh, I lived in Atlanta. I have stories too. I, could, I know. Yo, they walked up to me in the club and I said, You are the most beautiful woman I ever seen in my life. I want to marry you right then and there. I'm like, really? Dude? Marriage is like the first proposal. They don't care. They marry eight people. <laughs> no, no, no. You get married. You get married. Everybody is married. They don't fucking care about like, marriage. Oh. <laughs> and everybody has a baby, first of all. So, yeah. what is this? Swim to emotional. Yeah. Nah. Yo, gonna, they do cry. She's going to stab no you reason. in your sleep. <laughs> if you fuck up. <laughs> oh, Spanish Definitely. men like to, uh, you know what? Oh, I didn't talk about sex. Spanish men tend to just really be passionate about oral sex. That's Spanish women too, though. Damn, that was a good one. I'm not saying that I'm proud of that response. Sexy Brooklyn Siren said white men do too. They do it with no questions asked. Some disclosure: you gotta have money. Do you have money? No, but Spanish women, they're very, um, what's the word for? They are uh, not emotional. Um, passionate? They're passionate? Yeah, passionate. passionate. They're passionate. very culture too. I like Spanish women. Yeah, I like them. Because they bring their culture to you. Like, even though some of them, like, their grandparents might be racist, but the mom and the father, like, the first, you know, and they be a little more cultured. They're willing to talk to different kind of races. Family oriented. Right, yeah. definitely. That's a good one. And I agree. Then, um, I agree with that family oriented. And they speak Spanish no matter, like you said, like you see how we would, we would uh, code switch or whatever. Mm -hmm. They ain't code switch and they speak in Spanish. Mm -hmm. Whether they in front of you, Obama, anybody, they speak in Spanish. <laughs> Trump, they speak in Spanish. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Trump, they Trump I don't know if they speak in front of Trump with the deportation. Right. Right. 
they but I'm saying, if there was one culture that's going to keep it, they they would be, yeah, they would. Cool. So Asian women are submissive. Mm -hmm. And their fathers are crazy. Facts. <laughs> I've never heard that one before. You got a story to tell us? That's a story I've got, man. They're less well endowed. They're lesser endowed. That's, yeah. The men are. What do you think? It's called SNM, I think. What's that? The big bondage. Yeah. Sadomasochism. Yeah. What happened? What is it? Oh, yeah, that's sexual. They're into weird shit. Yeah. Yeah. Japanese. Yeah. 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 Is it Japanese? They did. I was watching a video where they was doing a viral. They was doing an orgy with mad people. Like, the big. They win the Guinness Book of Records for like the most orgies. You seen that video? They do Wait, how many people? It was like a giant bathroom. It must have been like a giant bathroom. Yeah, they, no, they didn't swap They didn't swap, it was just together. So 5,000 couples, basically. Wow. And, and Urban Plaza, basically. Wait, Queen, <laughs> Queen, T, <laughs> Queen T, 25 said, no experience whatsoever with Asian men. The stereotype of small penis stops yep. me. Yeah. Right. Yep. That, that, do, that, does, that does hold people back. Asian penis? And, and, then, oh, and they get dragged off of planes. I heard that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> so on the flip side, though, so rumor has it that, like, you know, the Asian woman's vagina is, like, looks different. You know what I'm saying? It's like, Right. No, not, not even tighter. There's like there's a urban myth that the way it's split mm -mm. is not mm -mm. normal. Mm -mm. How does it split? Wait, how does it? How does it? How does it how does Asian it? people. <laughs> Asian people are good at math. That's what the series is. <laughs> oh, the rumor has it that Asian women had sideways vaginas. Yeah. That, so so from 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 racist racist humor. Humor. Sideways? Yeah. Who would know the difference? <laughs> it's still a fucking cylinder. <laughs> As long as you can get in there, man. But it's natural. <laughs> Nobody thinking about all that. Yeah, it's like they they really pride on a bush. Right. Oh, Wait, what, oh. what do you mean? The, the hair. No, they don't. They don't shave. They don't shave. It's like, like a, I understand. Like, you know and I'm like, and I like it. You know, at least trim. <laughs> you know, like hair strip. Yeah, like a little hair strip or something. Or, or or you know, you can go bare. But like, they really pride on that. Yeah. Like what having, like having oh, no. a bush. Oh, no. like, so was it yeah. straight or sideways? Well, he's gonna show me because of hold on, Levon. Sorry. When you was putting it in, did you have to? Try to show him one more time. Did you have to go? Yeah. That they smell like curry. What? As far as what? Or sweat. Middle Eastern. Middle Eastern. Oh, yeah. yeah. They don't. They don't date outside. I don't even know they date outside. That's, That's like Pakistani. They, they yeah. yeah. They're Muslim. It's that would be that would be Kim Kardashian. She's from. Uh, or oh, she's Armenian. Armenian. Yeah. I mean, well, like I like I dated somebody that was hey, Indian yeah. and. God I would, I would damn it, say, you really be just like. Wow, baby, yeah. <laughs> you into next. Wait, what haven't you dated, Gene? I have Black. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 I don't mean any harm, but but if you step into an uh, Indian person home, it smells like curry. That's what I said. said. So, yeah. like, yeah. yeah. so, <laughs> so when I stepped in, I was like, oh okay, like smell like curry. Me too. Did you have sex with her? Yeah. Did she smell like curry? <laughs> they got money. All right, I have one stereotype. Zero stereotype. seasoning on the food. See what? Seasoning on the food. <laughs> oh my god, why they don't season the food? For yes, real? dry chicken, dry rice. <laughs> <laughs> but now nah, they're from the south, they're different. Yeah, right? the south, I, they I different. almost considered, like, you yeah, know, trying to date one girl from the south. It's they like, kiss their dogs. It's like white dogs. They do, though. <laughs> it's a little like dogs. Why do they kiss their dogs dog so much? In their mouth. In like, mouth. they call that, uh, uh, uh. Wait, time out. What are you doing? They kiss in clubs. Every time he goes to a club, a white girl is making out with somebody. Hey, Lots of that's that's high, right? so, a lot of PDA. This is because of the real world. I do not kiss in the club. I blame the real world from back in the day. That's what we do. So they just like are not, they don't have a like PDA when they get drunk. It's like, oh yeah, white girl wasted is a thing. It's a fact. Yeah. Wait, Emily, so sexy black siren said white men fuck like animals. Is this true? He's trying to shoot his like rabbit sex, like that's happened. <laughs> that's an animal. Sorry. That's happened. <laughs> well, you could have rabbit sex with a Not the kind of animal she was probably thinking about. <laughs> rabbit sex, rabbit sex, if you haven't watched Sex 
in the city. Carrie explains this already. What was that? It's like. <laughs> 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 Oh, okay, okay. I mean, Jack, so, okay, he calls it jackhammer. Yes. If, if you had to pick, like, if you had to pick like a beat for white people's sex, like what's what song does it sound? <laughs> Millie. <laughs> he said a Millie. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> what song does what song does white people's sex sound like? Stereotype that white women are easier. Okay. Like, every facet. Like, it's really easier to get into bed. It's is that easier the truth? to deal with. I wanna know. Is it true? true? Yeah, it is well, true. Why? Let's keep it a hundred. You can't prove that as a fact. Will I need to give you some attitude? Like, hey. uh uh. No, you no, ain't no. gonna get it like that. I had a white woman since AOL 3.0, so <laughs> <laughs> I can't speak on that. That's no, the truth. I was, I mean, I They're think. They're not easy, it's yeah. just yeah. more like open minded. Yeah. Open minded to talk to. Yeah. Open minded is the, is the path, the like, politically correct term for easy. That's what you guys want to say. I said, if you went to like a common a college that was like predominantly white folks, okay, and then you you and that was your only experience with them, I, I feel like you can say, oh, we are easy. But like in college, everyone's like, everybody's easy. Yeah. It's like, hey, oh my God, sex, let's do it. They don't, they don't, they're like my partying days are over. Yeah, they press the reset button. Yeah. Yo, I they didn't know that they it's have right. a different word for partying. So I was telling people, yeah, I used to party a lot. I'm starting to get serious about my my career. Mm -hmm. And everybody thought I was taking drugs. I didn't know that. I'm about to say that too. I'm about to say that too. They take a lot of drugs, right? So the terminology, okay, so terminology is completely different when you say partying in black people world and just like sex, we say hook. They say hook up. Mm -hmm. yeah, hook up. Yeah, hook up. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Careful with the terminology, because they now we're right. Keep me and packing this trip. So if y'all want to pick up a white, let me tell. If you need to pick up a white woman, Carol, can you give me a dress? Just <laughs> <laughs> White white people are just like a little bit more open to dating friends of friends of friends. Yeah. Yes. No, you're not my friend if you if you dated if you're dating my man, like if you date my ex. And they're just like, you know, I'm so sorry I slept with Billy, you know, and it's like everyone's okay. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's cool, we're white. And if it's not okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what I found is that sometimes if you just go up and talk to somebody about whatever, mm -hmm. they just get mad conversational. And sometimes you're like, oh shit, I didn't really want to talk this long. I just want to talk. <laughs> yeah, it's like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. They are highly chatty. It's been 20 minutes already. <laughs> <laughs> it's super chatty. Like, My dinner is burning. Yeah.